Oh lord. Let me see. Okay. What's up, y'all? This your girl Gold Mouth coming at y'all with another mukbang. Hey, 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 hey. Whoa. Okay, y'all. Today I got some leftovers, y'all. I am glad to be eating these leftovers one more time. How y'all doing out there today? Praise God, everybody. Praise the Lord. Um, I got leftovers, which is yellow rice, uh, green beans, and potatoes. And I got some big chicken. This has all been microwaved and I'm ready to eat. It's hot and ready to eat. So I need to hurry up for my food get cold. Because I don't like cold food, y'all. Um, and I got a good old glass of emptiness right here. Which is going to be my water. Y'all already know I got to get my daily dose of my two uh, cup bottles of water. I only drink two bottles of water a day. Look, him, look, okay. Get up here so you can be great. Two bottles of water I drank uh, of this a day. And that's it because I can't I can't do too much, okay? Should I just leave it up here? It's just so ignorant. No, I like my little cute one. So I'm gonna put my water in here, y'all. Well, let me go ahead and say my grace, because I'm ready. I'm hungry, my food getting cold. Okay, look. God is great. God is good. Lord, I thank you for my food. By my hands, you're my best friend, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, my daily bread. Amen. Lord, I ask that you um, bless this food and let me have no hurt, harm, or danger from this food, God, because I'm so ready to eat and I'm hungry, Lord. And anybody who's watching this video, Lord, I ask that you would bless them and let them have a great day today and tomorrow and every day beyond, okay? Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Okay, y'all, I got this here water here this water bottle here i'm gonna leave the link in the description below for this water bottle y'all because some a few of y'all asked me like where i got it from which i got it off amazon so uh i only put the water in this thing here for video purposes because i don't need this big old ignite water bottle in my face okay ASMR. that's ASMR, y'all close my eyes and waste it all over the floor Okay, y'all, I'm back. So, I had to put my water, y'all. See, good old water in my glass. Y'all, I need to give me some lemons or something to make it look a little festive because it's looking a little blah. I mean, it's just water. So, I mean, did I say my grapes? Yes, Lord. Thank you. So, how y'all doing out there today? Um, today is a good day today. I woke up happy. And um, it is what it is. I just, I'm just happy today. So, let me get into this food, y'all. I need to scoot up. I'm going to try to see if I can do... I'm going to try to see if I can do this video without editing, but I ain't even got my pillow. Child, I'm going to have to edit it anyway before I get my pillow. Nibby done got my pillow, y'all. I'll be liking to sit up in my chair so uh, I can be comfortable because other than that, if I sit in my chair the real way, I got to sit like this and my food like right here. Girl, I need to eat. Honey, let me get let me get this other pillow since she done stole mine. I'm going to steal hers, okay? This Nibby pillow right here. Oh, big old circle. So, um... How y'all doing out there today? Ooh, I ain't editing this video. Oh my God, it's just gonna be what it is, okay? Okay, all right. I had said that yesterday, then I ended up editing because I was like, oh my God, she just smacking. How can you How can you be like smacking in a video? It's like so, uh, no, not, I can't. It just, I, I, I mean, some smacks is okay, but then some smacks you're like, oh, wait. <laughs> I mean, me anyway, because I know mukbangs, that's what they do is smack, 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 but I ain't that brave yet, okay? Mm. Now, this water versus the water I had yesterday, it don't got no ice in it. So, I'm able to drink it down faster because it's not as cold. It is cold because it's been in the refrigerator all night, but... Ain't got no ice in it, but that ice give you a, a, a rush. You feel me? It give you a, a good old rush. I'm going to need this to go down some, honey, because I'm going to need my rice to be in my belly. I can't eat with no fault, y'all. <laughs> if y'all watch my videos, y'all already know I don't like faults, but I feel like I had to have faults since I got strain meat. It's just, it's only right, right? <laughs> I mean, ooh. That rice so tender. Tender. So, not tender, but soft and fluffy. Mm-hmm. So good. Mmm.
y'all, I gotta ask Gold Mouth question today. It really ain't a ask me, but I'm gonna put my two cents in anyway. I saw a question on the internet where a lady was asking. Well, I'm gonna talk about my food first. How I make this food. This is just yellow rice. This right here, green beans with some potatoes cut up in it. Oh my god. I might be finished before I even get started, y'all. I was hungry for this. I'm glad. I'm glad to be in service one more time. How many of y'all? How many of y'all out there? Glad to be done. Woke up this morning to see you another day. You know what? Some ungrateful people be mad that they woke up. Not saying they mad because they woke up. They just be wake up with an attitude. People. Some people just wake up with an attitude like. You ain't want to wake up this morning? Come on now. Nigga, you ain't want to wake up. I like being here. I like being on earth. With an elf. Mm, 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 mm. I was reading these comments in, the, um, in, one, in a couple of comment sessions. Y'all, I'm forever watching YouTube. I'm forever watching YouTube just like I t told y'all last night in my live. I'm not only a YouTuber, I am a subscriber, which gives me an opinion just like y'all have about other YouTubers and me. Um, so, I was looking at, I got my water on the wrong side again, right? Okay, so, we're going to switch it around because I'm not, I, I feel like it's on the wrong side because my hands, I'm right-handed, but. Mm. I'm just so used to my drink being on the right side. For video purposes, I need it to be. Uh, I need it to go together. You feel me? I need it to go be ergonomically correct. So, so yeah, I was I be watching these, the comment section in these videos. When I tell y'all, some of these videos, comment sections be giving me whole life, health, and strength. You feel me? I be looking at these comment sections and I be like, oh my god, the comment section be more entertaining than the doggone video. Cause they be some of them be like good comments, some of them be crazy comments. I was looking at a girl um, this morning. She relaxed her hair, and the whole comment section was like, "Oh my God, you finna go to hell? You gonna burn hell? Cause you relaxed your hair? Oh Lord, your hair gonna fall out? Jesus, you look better before? Oh, you should just learn to love yourself and embrace your natural naps and all." Okay, I'm like, Jesus, y'all just doing too much. I, you know what? Yeah, I thank God for y'all, cause y'all don't. Y'all don't come for me like that. Even even in my worst days, when I know I need somebody to tell me about myself, y'all know how to put me in my place in a nice way. Cause I be done cut somebody clean at for real. The whole the whole gold mouth will come up out of me. Cause I ain't even got that kind of time to have comments like that on my channel. Okay. And if it ever came to a point where I have to go through that and read, I wouldn't even come. I wouldn't even respond to my comments no more. I don't know. I don't, now, yes, I would. I would respond. Because <laughs> I like responding because... Mm, mm. I like responding because I like to communicate with y'all. But if it ever came to a point of people coming for me like that, old oh, Gomak gonna come up out of me. You hear me? So I will be responding. Mm. Baked chicken, y'all. Mm. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, they come at the um, cutie Q, cutie Q, is that her name, cutie Q? But Q, even with Q or Quake or Q, this other girl, she trying to like, she do videos like be loved. Boy, when, they t when I tell you they come for her and her smacking and her sound, not furping and sounds, when she clearly put it in her, um, her intro. If you don't like slurping, burping, moaning, smacking sounds, you need to go. <laughs> like, that's what she said before we even watched the video. But then everybody in their mama come comment, oh my god, you burp too much, you smack too much, you do this too much. She already told y'all in the beginning what she was gonna do, what she was back. So how you there? I don't understand. I don't understand some folk. I'm scared my rice gonna disappear, y'all. Mm. 
time to get a rifle on this. I ain't even looking at y'all to fool so good. So, I'm going to try to do this video without it. So, if you see anything stupid, then oh, no, oh well. So, anyways, I wanted to talk to y'all about this question. Okay. It was on the internet. Okay, so the lady asked. I was asked Steve. Hold on, let me drink. The lady is, like, a single woman. I guess she's single. I don't know. But she asked Steve. Steve, my, my baby's father moved across the country and he want to see his daughter. Should I send her? He want me to send her to him. My five-year-old girl, five years old now, he want her to send the daughter across the country. So Steve asked, you know, does he help do for the child or whatever and all of that. And she said, no, financially he's not there. Financially he ain't there. He crossed country, but Check this out. He met, he went cross country with the lady that he cheated on her with, the baby mom. And Steve's advice was, you should let your child go. Go and go with her. But the thing is, I'm, I'm going to tell you that in a, in a second. I don't know where this video cut off at, but first of all, the little foodie that you're messing with, don't like me. Nine times out of ten, the other girl, they don't like each other, okay? Nine times out of ten. So, second of all, my baby five years old and she's a little girl. You think I'm going to sit across country by herself to be with you? And you don't pay no kind of bills. You don't help me with no child support, no nothing. Like, like, like for real. Like, be for real. For serious. You is not, you is not finna get my baby. At all. So I don't know, I don't even know why, what the question was. Talking about, yes, he a good dad. He can't be a good dad if he went way across the country and then he don't send no baby no money or nothing. Mm-mm. Girl, you better wake up. The only time you gonna see my baby, you come this way, you come back across the country because you the one took your behind over there. And then make it so bad you went over there with the little mistress girl or whatever she was you was messing with and cheated on me with. Oh, no. Baby. And Steve said, oh, the problem ain't with her and the daddy. The problem with her and the girl. And the girl said, no, the problem ain't with her and the girl. And I'm like, oh, the problem with me and the girl and the daddy. <laughs> Period. Like, you ain't finna be... Talking about you finna get my child. Then my child gotta be over there with you and her? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. It ain't going down. Call me what you want. You can call me the crazy baby mama from hell or whatever you want to call me, but it ain't finna go down and you ain't finna get my baby. At all. You can run tell that or whatever you want to do. But you fight that. Especially if you don't give me no money. You don't see her no support. A five-year-old need a lot of stuff. Steve told the lady that, um, well, we worry about the money is the wrong thing. Uh-uh. No, I'm worried about the money. Because I'm sitting up here struggling, trying to pay these bills and take care of the baby myself every time she need school clothes, every time she need food. I got to do it all by myself. Okay, I understand that. Yeah, she the baby mama and she made her own bed, so now she got to lay in it. But you really doing nothing for my child and you want to see my child, you ain't finna see my child. You better make some arrangements and you better act like you want to do something. I ain't gonna keep the child away from you, but you gonna um you not finna keep no money away from the child, vice versa. Me and I always be having a problem. Oh, you trying to keep my baby away from me. Well guess what? You trying to keep your baby from living the best life she could because she needs your help, you stupid dummy. Girl, don't get me started. Children need their fathers, yes they do. And guess what? The children also need their fathers financially as well. Men seem to forget about that. Oh, as long as um she know I'm her dad or whatever. She's going to be okay. No, they're not. There's going to be one day that, that she's going to ask you, to, you know, pay, can she go to prom and all that stuff. Who going to pay for it? Not your broke behind. Most baby daddies are either broke or they just selfish. So if you're going to be a broke, selfish person in your life, don't have no kids. Period. And that's all I got to say in this video. And I'll holler at y'all later. Bye. <laughs> I was like, what, Steve? You just gave her the dumbest advice. But then it was people on the, 
the little people in the comment section was like, Steve, you should know more than anybody how to answer that question because you're going through the same thing. And I was like, oop. Oop, there it is. Mm -mm. So, people be hardcore. And y'all, he, he shaved his mustache. What y'all think about that situation? Like, would you send your baby across country by herself to go be with her daddy that don't do nothing for her? They just talk on the phone every now and again. She said she he don't even call her. She don't he don't even call and check on his baby. She got to call him to tell her you know how the baby doing or whatever. You you clean cross country. You wouldn't even call and check on your own child. And now you talk about you want to see a nigga, please. No. I don't care who don't like it, who don't agree with me, but no. Not finna go down. Mm -mm. That's crazy, y'all. So y'all chime in on the situation. I want y'all I wanna see y'all comments. I wanna read my comment section to see what's, what's what the business is. You know. See me and you see eye to eye, cause I ain't mm mm. She a five year old baby girl. Baby, and what that little helpful? What was that helpful over, over whatever supposed to be stepmama? You know she already got beef with the, the mama. So if you got beef with me, you not finna be chilling with my baby like that, no ma'am. Cause if you don't like me, it, you don't like her, and we don't like you. Period. It ain't finna happen. It ain't finna happen. Mm, 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 mm. I'm good me need chicken there, y'all. I got a case of chicken the other day. Chicken legs from Piggly Wiggly. A whole case. $14.99. I was so happy. I was happy as heck. I said, ooh, I need to wait till there. I got the last case too. There were people in there lined up. I didn't even know they was having a sale. So I pulled in the parking lot because New Year. Needed some diapers or some child. I don't know what I was doing. I, I heard the people in the parking lot talking about um, the sale on the chicken. So I went in there to be nosy. The sale on the chicken. I'm like, wait a minute. What I'm missing now? Hold up. Swole up. I need to see what's going down. Because we ain't got no food. We ain't got no meat left. We got some leg quarters in there. But I need to restock. But I'm so over leg quarters right now that because I get leg quarters by the case. When I did get them cases, it was like $10 or whatever, but I got legs. I don't want the, the whole quarters no more. I'm done. I done ate so many leg quarters in my life now, girl, that I'm just like, I don't want no more for a long time. And I know legs is almost like leg quarters, but they ain't got a thigh connected to them. I could eat, because this, leg quarters is so hard. You got to clean them and get all the fat off of them and stuff like that. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I ain't got that kind of time no more. That's too much, too much going on. I be tired before I even put them in the oven. So with the legs already cut off, you ain't got to do them like that. So that's why I got the box of legs. And I was happy to get that book that case. And I thought of that. It was solid froze too. I had to leave it on the counter overnight. And it was still solid froze the next morning. Well, I didn't leave it over the counter. I didn't leave it on the counter overnight. I left it on the counter, like, during that daytime so it could thaw. And then I put it in the refrigerator that night. And then I took it back out the next day and let it sit on the counter again. Because it was blocked up. So I finally um, ended up bagging it up and putting it in the freezer. So we got legs for days, honey. I thought it ended up being 100 because I put 12 pieces in there per bag. So I think, be, and I had like 12 bags. What's 12 times 12? 144? Mm-hmm. 144 legs was enough for $14. Mm-mm-mm. Not one little leg left, y'all. Yeah, but y'all, that's crazy. I don't know what I had to, like, be in no predicament like that, get nobody across country and stuff like that, but so I please, I bet you one thing, you won't be getting my baby. You're gonna have to do better about yourself, and you're gonna have to do better about my baby. 
You already disrespect the mama. What makes me think you won't disrespect my baby too? Mm-mm. I did, but we don't got the whole story of the girl now. I don't know if the girl knew whether or not that she was in a relationship with the dude before she got with Because, you know, some dudes be like, oh, I'm single. And be wifed up as heck, you know. Because they be lying. Nobody got time for all that. Now, but if she did know, I thought Tiana. <laughs> no, ma'am. Cause I'm not finna trust you with my baby, especially when you cross country and I can't just come and get her something and go down. Uh-uh, baby. Mm-mm. First of all, since he don't do nothing, he finna get put on some child support. And that's the dog on the show. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I enjoyed this food, job So good. Take my little water. Yes, y'all. So y'all let me know what y'all think of that. I'm going to try to make my mukbangs a little bit shorter than normal. 20 minutes is my max that I want to do. Okay, let me do 24. 24 minutes or less because my camera shuts off every 12 minutes. So I'm going to do 12 and 12 and, that, and that's going to be a wrap, y'all. If I eat all my food or not, it is going to be what it is because then I'm going to hush. Unless the conversation get real juicy, y'all. Anyway, y'all, I hope y'all having a good day out there today. I ain't finna drink my, my day to water. Look how much water fit in that cup, y'all. That was a lot. And here. Let me see if I can wash it down. I don't want to dry later, ma'am. Still here, I ain't dry yet. <laughs> yes, y'all. What that lady man who said that somebody drowned trying to drink their water real fast so they could pass a drug test for a job? Child, you really wanted that job. I guess you got a new one. He got high, but he didn't get high there. So I believe. Mm mm mm. I'm good. <laughs> I'm greedy today, y'all. Now I ate my whole meal with a fork. How? Oh, turn up. <laughs> I'm having trouble right now, though. Anyway, you guys, I'm going to get out of here. I done lost my napkin and everything, chap. There you go. Y'all, thanks so much for watching me. I appreciate y'all for joining the discussion today. Y'all, comment down below y'all thoughts. Um, and that's all I got to say. In this video, you guys, if you're still here to the end of this video, comment chicken chicken y'all chicken chicken head all right y'all thanks you guys so much for watching so i gotta see in this video and i will holler at y'all later bye